are suggestive of there being some kind of particle, so that's like this stuff, like electrons and things, but some kind of particle that's quite heavy and does not interact with light. What lies beyond the edge of the universe? What happens after space-time itself comes to an end? These questions have haunted scientists and philosophers alike for centuries, with no real answers, until now. Microsoft's latest Azure Back simulation may have just cracked it wide open. By combining quantum computing with cutting-edge cosmology, this simulation has ventured beyond the boundaries of the observable universe, and the results are staggering. For the first time, we have a glimpse of what exists beyond the cosmos as we know it, but is it just a cosmic illusion, or does it hint at something far deeper? A hidden structure, or maybe even a multiverse waiting to be discovered? This isn't theoretical speculation anymore. The latest breakthroughs from Microsoft Azure's quantum-powered engine might have just unlocked the most profound mystery of all. What's really beyond the universe? The Azure Cosmology Engine. So let's break down how Microsoft's Azure team managed to achieve this feat. Microsoft has been leading the charge with its Azure Quantum Platform, a powerful combination of classical high-performance computing, HPC, and quantum-inspired algorithms. But what makes this project even more exciting is that it isn't just about running simulations. It's about using the quantum-enhanced capabilities of Azure to simulate the early universe at unprecedented levels of detail. To understand this, we have to talk about the Planck Epoch, the first moments after the Big Bang, when space-time itself was in its infancy. During this time, conventional physics as we know it doesn't apply. We enter into a realm where quantum mechanics, gravity, and the fabric of space-time all become intricately intertwined. This is where scientists have struggled, trying to simulate this period accurately with classical computers. But now with quantum computing, the Azure engine has the ability to go beyond these physical constraints. It can simulate scenarios in which quantum mechanics governs the fabric of space-time itself allowing scientists to explore the limits of the universe beyond what we can observe with traditional tools. The results were far from expected. The simulation didn't just replicate what we already know about the universe. It uncovered irregularities, voids of pressure at the outermost boundaries of space-time that shouldn't exist according to known physics. These anomalies are unlike anything ever predicted in current cosmological models. What does this mean? Simply put, we may have just simulated the edge of reality itself. Before we dive deeper into these wild discoveries, let's take a step back and understand why this simulation is so revolutionary. First, a little context. For decades, physicists have been trying to model the early universe. We've built massive telescopes, launched satellites like the Planck and WMAP missions, and fired up particle colliders like the Large Hadron Collider to dig deeper into the nature of the cosmos. But there's always been one fundamental problem. The edge of the universe, that boundary beyond which we can't observe, has been, well, completely unobservable. Until now. That's where Azure's quantum simulation comes into play. Microsoft's supercomputing engine doesn't just simulate observable space. It pushes the limits of our perception, creating an artificial space-time model that transcends classical constraints. And here's the kicker. It's not just making predictions based on known physics, it's revealing new undetected structures in the fabric of space itself. This is what makes the discoveries so mind-blowing. We now have evidence pointing to a pressure void, a massive area beyond the observable universe where the normal rules of physics seem to fall apart. What are these voids? Why don't they exist in the models we've been using for decades? Could they be the key to understanding what lies outside our universe? Now that we have the basics down, let's talk about a theory that might help us understand what these strange voids are. Enter digital physics, a field of thought that suggests the entire universe behaves like a quantum computer. This isn't science fiction, it's a growing branch of theoretical physics. Leading thinkers like Stephen Wolfram and Seth Lloyd have proposed that the universe itself may not be made up of particles or fields in the traditional sense. Instead, it could be built from information constantly processed by some kind of cosmic computational system. In this context, the simulation on Microsoft's Azure platform is more than just a model of the universe. 
it might be revealing the underlying information structure of reality itself. The voids found at the edge of the universe in this simulation could be the computational limits, areas where our current understanding of physics breaks down. These regions don't just represent empty space, they could represent boundaries where the flow of information reaches its maximum. Think about it. If reality is information-based, then those irregularities in the simulation are far from random. They might be a glitch in the system, a point where reality itself can't be rendered any further, much like hitting the limits of a computer's processing power. Could this mean that the true nature of the universe is simply a massive, self-sustaining computational process? If this is true, we may not just be living in a physical universe, we may be part of an immense informational structure, one that is constantly evolving and evolving beyond what we can understand. So we've discussed how these irregularities appear at the edges of the simulation, but the real jaw dropper? Microsoft's Azure team also flagged unexplained fluctuations in quantum noise. These fluctuations weren't coming from anything inside the simulated universe. Instead, they appeared to originate from outside the observable model. In other words, something is communicating with our universe, but from beyond it. Some researchers suggest that these signals could be informational echoes, waves or particles bouncing off a structure outside of our universe, reverberating into the quantum fabric of reality itself. This is a bold, radical theory, but one that matches the anomalous results observed in the Azure simulation. Imagine it. The simulation is revealing a kind of cosmic ping, like a sound wave bouncing back from the very edge of existence. If these signals are real, then they might not just be random noise. They could be the first hints of something outside our universe interacting with it, something beyond our perception of space-time. Let's take a breath here, because what we're talking about is wild. We're not just looking at random anomalies. We're looking at evidence that could suggest something is beyond the very fabric of our universe, interacting with it in ways we haven't even begun to fully understand. What if everything we thought we knew about reality is only the tip of the iceberg? If these irregularities are indeed echoes from something outside of space-time, does that mean there's an entire multiverse out there? Or is our universe part of an even bigger structure, one that transcends everything we can perceive? And if you've made it this far, it's clear you're into the deep stuff. Hit like and let us know your theory in the comments. Is this the edge of our universe, a multiverse, or something else entirely? Now let's dig even deeper. One of the most fascinating aspects of this Azure simulation is that it aligns perfectly with boundary physics. The idea that the universe could have an edge or a boundary that shapes its very structure. Scientists like Roger Penrose and Stephen Hawking have long theorized about boundary states, and this simulation could be offering proof. One particularly exciting possibility is the idea of an anti-universe, a universe where time runs backward, entropy decreases, and the laws of physics mirror our own, but in reverse. If this anti-universe exists, it might be entangled with our universe, forming a kind of cosmic dualism where both universes balance each other. The Azure simulation seems to support this idea with certain fluctuations matching what we'd expect from an entangled system, an anti-universe linked to our own. If this is true, we might have just simulated a cosmic twin, a mirror universe outside of our space-time, and it might be just as real as our own. Here's where things really take a turn. Microsoft's Azure team fed the simulation without using the known cosmic microwave background, CMB, the fossil radiation from the Big Bang that we rely on to study the early universe. The result? A self-consistent universe with altered physical constants, a multiverse node where the laws of physics are entirely different. This doesn't just hint at the possibility of a multiverse, it shows that there may be universes with completely different rules different constants in different realities. The fact that the simulation stabilized a version of this altered universe for longer than expected suggests that it's not just a random anomaly, it's a real possibility. And that means the universe beyond our own could be more than just a space. It could be a self-contained process, a closed loop system that we simply haven't discovered yet. So what does all of this mean? 
Microsoft's Azure simulation didn't just provide us with another complex model of the universe, it opened a portal to something far deeper. It didn't just simulate the observable cosmos as we know it, but ventured far beyond, providing us a glimpse of what might lie at the edges of everything we can comprehend. What the simulation revealed isn't just a mathematical abstraction, it's a hint at something truly extraordinary, a reality that operates beyond the confines of space, time, and even the known laws of physics. Could it be that the universe has no true edge? For centuries, humans have pondered the vastness of the cosmos, imagining it to have some kind of boundary, a point beyond which there is nothing. But what if this idea is fundamentally wrong? What if there is no sharp boundary that marks the end of our universe, but rather a continuous, self-sustaining process, a mechanism that constantly evolves and gives birth to the very fabric of existence? This might suggest that the universe is not a static object with defined edges, but an ongoing dynamic system where the boundary we've always imagined is an illusion. In other words, the edge of the universe could be a constantly shifting frontier, one that extends and adapts based on the deeper forces at play within the fabric of reality itself. If this is true, then the implications are staggering. What we've thought of as the limit of existence might actually be part of an ongoing process that cannot be defined in conventional terms. The forces shaping the universe could be far more complex, fluid, and interconnected than we have ever realized. The idea of a boundary itself may only be an artifact of our perception, an outdated concept that no longer applies in this more expansive, quantum-driven understanding of the cosmos. This brings us to another profound possibility, the source code of existence. Just as computer programs are created from lines of code, what if the universe itself is structured in a way that is governed by a deeper, fundamental set of rules? Rules that are woven into the very fabric of space-time? These rules, or codes, might define not just the behavior of particles or the laws of physics, but also the very processes that allow existence to unfold. What if the Azure simulation didn't just model our universe? What if it accidentally revealed the deep patterns that underlie everything? These patterns emerging from the quantum realm could point toward the most fundamental layer of reality, a layer we've never been able to access until now. Perhaps, just maybe, we're on the cusp of understanding that the universe isn't a static structure, but a living, ever-evolving mechanism that we've only scratched the surface of. Our perception of reality bound by time and space might be a construct, a necessary framework for us to interact with the physical world. But beyond that framework, there might be layers of existence that we cannot even begin to fathom with our current understanding. We are not merely on the edge of the universe in a physical sense, but at the threshold of understanding the deeper processes that allow the universe to exist in the first place. What if everything we think we know about reality, about time, space, and the very structure of the cosmos is merely a glimpse of a much more intricate, complex, and vast system? If this simulation by Microsoft's Azure is correct, we might have just encountered a new paradigm for reality itself. We might be seeing not just the physical universe we know, but the deeper blueprints that guide its formation, behavior, and ultimately its evolution. In fact, this could be just the beginning. If the Azure simulation is right, then we've only begun to scratch the surface of a vast, uncharted territory that lies beyond the universe. This beyond is not just about the physical cosmos as we understand it, but about the nature of existence itself. It's about discovering the underlying principles that govern not just what we see, but everything that we don't see. The forces, dimensions, and structures that could be right in front of us, yet remain invisible to our current methods of observation. We are standing at the threshold of a potential revolution in how we understand the cosmos. What we once thought were fixed laws of nature could turn out to be mere approximations of a much deeper reality. Our scientific understanding, powerful as it is, might only be revealing fragments of a greater whole. The Azure simulation has shown us a glimpse of this deeper, more complex reality, and the possibilities are endless. Could this simulation, along with the revolutionary discoveries it holds, be the key to unlocking the greatest mysteries of the universe? The search for answers has just begun, 
As we stand on the precipice of this new understanding, the question becomes, what if we've been looking at the universe the wrong way all along? What if reality is not just a series of observable phenomena, but an interconnected process that shapes our experience of existence itself? With new technologies like Microsoft Azure's quantum simulation, the door is now open to a future where we can begin to understand the vastness of existence in ways we never thought possible. And that journey, that pursuit of deeper knowledge, might just reveal the true nature of the universe and beyond. If this discovery changed how you see the universe, you won't want to miss what's next. Subscribe and turn on notifications so you don't miss it. And in our next deep dive, scientists just detected a quantum signal in interstellar space. And it might not be natural.